Alice Chalmers started building this tractor in uh, 1929. According to the serial number, this is, was the first one built in 1930, the second year. The United Company was formed by several little companies that got together and they decided they seen a good market for a utility tractor still. So they went to Alice Chalmers to ask them if they'd build it and Alice Chalmers did with the agreement that, that they would also be able to build one with their name on it. So this is the United, has the United name on the front. The Alice Chalmers tractor that they built had Alice Chalmers across the front. I've got enough parts to build at least one of the Alice Chalmers tractors down the road, so hopefully one of these days I'll be able to have a pair of them to show. A friend of mine located it out in uh, eastern Colorado. He called me one day and said, I found a tractor I think you might be interested in. When I uh, restored this tractor, the fan belt was in bad shape. I got to talking to a friend of mine up in uh, Iowa, told him I was going to have to buy one of these reproduction fan belts, and I thought, you know, I'd rather have something that looks a little better than, than those. And he says, well, go home and check your book, see what that part number is. I bought out an old Alice Chalmers dealership, and I think I may have a new old stock fan belt hanging on the wall. So I called him, told him what the number was. Sure enough, he had it. And so I've got that new fan belt on here and it has Alice Chalmers in orange letters down the side of the, the uh, fan belt. And then another item I think is kind of unique. This is the way the oil pressure gauge originally was screwed on down here at the block. And the farmer that used this tractor put this pipe on here to get it up closer to the hole in the dash where he could see it easier. And I thought, that looks pretty good. So I, I'm just gonna leave it just the way he did it there. I'm at the point now where I'm gonna have to slow down because I've run out of room to store everything. 